index of life with the possibility of parole. With respect to count two, felony murder, that will merge into count one and is dismissed as a matter of law. With respect to count three, aggravated assault, that merges into counts one and two. With respect to count four, felony murder, that merges into count one and it is dismissed as a matter of law. With respect to count five, the false imprisonment uh, verdict, the court imposes a sentence of eight years consecutive. With respect to count six, possession of a firearm during the commission of a felony, the court imposes a sentence of five years that will run consecutive uh, to the underlying sentence. Count seven and eight will merge into count six. So the court's total sentence is life with the possibility of parole plus eight years consecutive on the false imprisonment and five years consecutive on the possession of firearm during the commission of a felony. And that is the court sentence. So I will remind you again, Ms. Payne, into the custody of the Sheriff's Department. And the pain just sentenced to life with the possibility of parole. Man. I didn't think she was going to get life. I, <clears throat> I was hoping she'd get a significant amount of time. But I didn't think she, I didn't think she was going to get life. But, man, the dispatcher told her multiple times, like, don't follow him. She took it into her own hands to follow that man. Not only followed him, blocked him off. Like, she was a cop. Like, blocked him off. And then, you know, approached him. You know, uh, altercation ensued. And results of uh, her taking another uh, person's life over a minor traffic incident that he had stopped after he hit the, uh, the tractor trailer. But, you know, he was having a, they say he was having a medical issue. So he, he, he left the scene and she just, you know, took matters in her own hand. And uh, them few seconds caused her and result life, life imprisonment. You know, that, that the choices we make and she got to live with that. She ruined that man's life and her life, her family's life and his family's life. And a lot of people are affected by our actions, you know, so you gotta be mindful of that. Um, that. So, um, what y'all think? Was that warranted for her to get life? Let me know, help me out in the comments.